we're having Superhero Day. Um, Superhero Day is set up for kids 12 and under. Of course, we will have some adults here, but it's a fun time that our youth puts on, and it was actually the youth's idea to put on. And they come in, um, they'll dress up, they'll help with crafts. We'll have a few special characters here for the kids to see and get their pictures made with. We have a craft, we have some light refreshments, and we have a scavenger hunt. When I was a little kid, I was enamored with Batman. I've watched every Batman show, every Batman movie. I have a Batman tattoo. My kids are embarrassed by it. My kids are embarrassed by me here, which is one reason why I'm here, so. He is a normal human being that uses his own athletic ability and his own intelligence to, to make the world a better place. When you were a little child, who was your favorite superhero? Oh, uh, probably Captain America. I loved everything he stood for, and he's very handsome. <laughs> what does Captain America stand for? He stands for America, he stands for what's right. Love it. I'll be running the bingo game, superhero bingo. Well, where they all have all the kids come in and stuff, and all the people, and I'll call out the numbers. It'll be fun. He's Captain America is a really good influence on children these days, and he's American hero because he promotes strength and to have the courage to do things that others won't do. Hi, I'm Sergeant Don Hodges with the City of Anderson Police Department Technical Rescue Team and as you can see here below me at my feet this is Copper the Bloodhound. I have had Copper about two years. He was actually, a, he is a rescue dog. His owner said he was a little bit too rambunctious for her and her small children and I found him at the, out here at the Paws out on the 29 Bypass and he's been with me for about, me and my wife for about two years now. Copper actually works for the technical rescue team and he, we track missing people, whether it be Alzheimer's patients, uh, lost children and such as that. 